learn how to use your Abbott Eterna Rechargeable Spinal Cord Stimulation System Charger to manage chronic pain. We will go over how to pair your charger with your controller, when to charge, setting up your charging apparel, and charging the system. Before you use your charger for the first time, you may want to pair the charger with your patient controller. When these devices are paired, you can use your controller to monitor charging sessions, adjust charger settings such as volume control, and perform charger software updates. To prepare the charger for pairing, you will need to do the following. Ensure that your controller and charger are charged. Open the patient controller app and place near the charger. Turn on the charger by pressing the power icon. Press and hold the power icon on the charger for five seconds. And then release the button. The power icon and the battery icon will blink once. Then, the power icon will blink quickly, indicating the charger is in the pairing state. On the controller, select the plus sign icon, then select the charger you are pairing. Plan a charging schedule with your clinician that works best to maintain effective therapy and establish a routine. Your controller indicates the battery level of your generator when you open the app. This can range from 0 to 100%. When you connect to your generator, your controller also indicates the approximate stimulation time remaining before needing to recharge based on the generator's current battery level and therapy settings. When your implanted generator battery is low, your controller displays a low battery message. When this appears, charge your generator at your earliest convenience. If you do not charge your generator after the low battery message appears, your stimulation will eventually stop and then your controller will display an alert indicating therapy was turned off due to a low generator battery. You must charge your generator battery so that therapy can be restored. Your charging system comes with reusable charging apparel. It is optional for you, but it can help stabilize the charger over your generator during a charging session. To set up your lumbar charging apparel, follow these steps. If the charger is connected to the charger cable, disconnect it. Press the power icon to turn on. The three charger icons illuminate briefly and it will beep once if sound is enabled. Insert the charger fully into the mesh pocket of the charging apparel with the icons facing the opening of the pocket. Ensure the elastic edges of the pocket overlap and charger is fully covered. Wrap the charging apparel around your waist, aligning the charger on your back, over your implanted battery. Adjust the Velcro strap so the apparel is secure and the charger is on top of your generator. When the charger and generator are aligned and charging begins, you will hear a series of repeating beeps with a low tone followed by a high tone. If the charger does not find the generator within 90 seconds, it turns off automatically. Press the power icon through the mesh pocket to turn on the charger and align the charger over your generator. Only charge your generator while you are awake so that you can stop it if charging becomes uncomfortable. To confirm charging is occurring, note the following. If the charger sound is enabled in the charger settings, the charger beeps when charging begins. When charging is in progress, the charger will not beep. The charger power icon blinks slowly while charging is in progress. The controller displays the charging status and the generator battery level when you open the app. If you do not note any of these indicators, charging is not occurring. If the charger loses alignment with the generator for 10 seconds, the charger will beep until alignment with the generator is restored or the charger is turned off. Try repositioning the charger so it is positioned over the generator. When the generator is fully charged, the charger beeps three times every 10 seconds if sound is enabled. You can also view charging status on the controller by connecting to your generator. And change charging mode. Turn off the charger before removing the charging apparel. For more information or troubleshooting support, contact technical support or your local Abbott representative. Warning: You may perceive an increase in temperature at the generator site while you charge. Ensure that the area around the charger is well ventilated and not covered by an insulating material such as a blanket. If you feel discomfort while recharging your generator, stop using the charger and refer to the troubleshooting section of your Eterna SCS System Model 16000 Charging System User's Guide. If the discomfort persists, contact your clinician 
Only charge your generator while you are awake, so that you can stop the charger if charging becomes uncomfortable. If your clinician has enabled the charging mode feature, change the charging mode to low. See the patient controller manual for more information about this feature. If you feel discomfort at the implant site while charging your generator, stop using the charger. Use your patient controller to change the charging mode or contact your physician 